Solos, and today we are back with Frambo. I am 100% going to butcher the voices. It's been forever since I played this game. And I'm probably going to kill my voice trying to do Fran's voice because I remember how that one goes. It's super high pitched. Like, holy shit. Any hoosies, we are going to continue on with a whole bunch of stuff. I don't know what that is. Examine. Oh, it's the puzzle box. Okay. Uh. There's the bridge. I knew we were on the other side. Moonlight shine. It's very romantic. My boots are quite dirty. I have to clean them when I get home. Okay. Ah, pills. Are these my pills? Wow, but where are they going? Um, I guess home is in that direction. Hills, don't move. Ah! You want to show me the way back home? Ah. Oh no! I shouldn't have touched the pills. Bad friend, bad, bad! Um, we're trapped forever and ever. Um, knife. Use. You're already here. Wow, I wasn't expecting you until 2.35. And as I see, you are not trapped anymore. Interesting. What kind of voice is this? Anyways, let me introduce myself. I am Edward, your faithful friend. Edward, do I know you from somewhere? You seem familiar. Yes, I'm the creature of the night. We've been playing together. I helped you to get Mr. Midnight back, you see. Really? Huh. I think I managed quite well to find my kitty on my own. Hey, aren't you the one that made the sisters mad? No, it wasn't It wasn't me making the sisters mad. They believed it was me. You see, but that's because they never looked into themselves. What do you mean by they never looked into themselves? They blamed me instead of facing the fact that their parents never loved them. But let's stop talking about the sisters, shall we? Don't you recognize me, dear Fran, the long man with the top hat? I always came by night and told you stories when you were just a little baby. I came to you after you imagined me. But I'm not imaginary. You see, I'm part of your reality. Did I imagine you? You look quite familiar. Yes, I can't deny that. I exist because you exist. The truth is that you were able to imagine me because I already existed. Anyway. We don't have time to talk about this right now. Actually, I'm here to ta take you home. Follow me. Take me home? I can't let you do that. I don't know. I don't know you. I won't hurt you. I'm not made out of darkness. You're my friend. Hmm. All right. You seem nice. I'll go with you, but I won't trust you yet. That's fine. Come on now. I have something to show you. Oh shit. <laughs> You're tall, my skeletal dude. I swear, doing voices is sometimes the funnest yet weirdest part of doing these kind of games. It's fun. Behold, the Edward flying machine. What do you think? I love it. It has many buttons to push. Yes, with this gorgeous piece of machinery, I'll take you home. Hello? Cuckoo? We'll fly as soon as I fix the dials. The, the details. Besides, it's not 235 yet. That sounds great, but what is about 235, sir? I don't understand. It's when time becomes slower that gives us a chance to enter the ultra reality. Inside the ultra reality, we can travel wherever we want to go. Right now, we are standing on the endless limits of second reality. But you are part of the third reality. Do you understand? Yes, I do understand. It sounds insane. But, sir, should I just wait until you are done fixing the machine? 
for it? Of course not. You can help by getting water and fireberries. All right? All right. It's better to do something than nothing at all, I guess. Great. Here is my amazing handmade bucket for the water. I made it myself. Ah. ah and the fireberries. You'll re realize which berries to pick up because of the fire. All right. But, sir, can I just ask? Why do you need the berries in the water? Ah, well, the berries are incredibly good fuel. They last many, many hours. And the water is to get rid of the dirt. The Kamalas. Oh, Kamalas, I see. I hope they don't come around the flying machine. We never know. But we know that they don't like the water. Yes. Oh, darling, I almost forgot. Your medicine. You need it. Some things are still invisible to your eyes, you see. Yeah. I got the pills back. Invisible to my eyes? Hmm. I see. Well, thank you. I was trying to catch the pills earlier, but the trap caught me first. Oh, yes, about that. I'm sorry. I needed to get your attention somehow. It's okay, sir. I defeated the trap, like, in one second. Anyway, I'll go get the fireberries in the water. I'll be right back. Great, I'll be preparing the machine. Okie dokie. Back on the trail. I honestly have... Well, these look like berries. I wonder if they're on fire. It is. Hello, Mr. Moose. Get out, get out. You're trespassing on my territory. Huh? Excuse me? I thought you were dead. How can you possibly think that? You have no manners, young lady. I'm very sorry, but you seem to be all rotten and bloody. Me? Rotten and bloody? I think you are misunderstanding the situation. Why do you say that, Mr. Moose? Mr. Moose! I am not a moose. I'm a dead weedle worm. A deadly worm? Excuse me, a deadly worm? No, no, not a deadly worm. A deadly worm. I don't go around killing creatures. Just give back to the soil what creatures took from it and don't need any more. But I only see a talking moose. Where are you? Down here, creature. Can't you see me? Oh, there you are. You are so tiny. Hello, my name is Fran. Hello, Fran. Can I ask, why did you touch the moose in the first place? Normally, only scavengers would touch dead animals. Are you one? Of course not. I was trying to see if I could climb on it to reach the fireberries. I see. I think it is possible. The moose is so very sturdy and solid. But the fireberries are on fire. You can hurt yourself. Yes, I see the fire. But I have to take them somehow. Good luck with that. Climb on now. I'll keep working. Thank you, sir. Okay. Use. Hmm. Hmm. We have to climb down. It's still very sturdy. It's so shiny. Hello again. Hello. Are you those shiny insects that get stuck on trees because of curiosity? We usually get stuck, yes. How do you know this? You are not one of us? I met some of your kind before. I helped them to get free from curiosity. Ah, that is very nice of you. Curiosity can lead us to unexpected situations. Yes, I think curiosity is a good thing, but are you stuck? Not at all. We're just trying to make our hair the longest hair ever. Oh, that's 
Sounds amazing. Good luck. I have to go now. Bye. Okay. Huh. Kamala's? I need to get rid of the pills for right now because I need water and the only way I can get water is from this way. Like that. Use water. Hmm. I wonder if I can use the hairs. I'm gonna ask if I can use the hair. I need help, please. Would you allow me to, to tie this bucket to your beautiful hair? Tie a bucket to our hair? Why? That sounds insane. Oh, it's not insane at all. I need water from under the cliff, but I can't reach it. I need to use your beautiful long hair as a rope. Please help me. All right, we'll help you. Tie the bucket real tight. Okay, thank you. You're very nice. Fill up the whole bucket, please. The bucket is now full of water. Oh, thank you, shiny insects. I have to go now. I have to go home. Home is somewhere we all wish to belong, but does not. But does but does home belong somewhere? What? I don't understand. I didn't really understand the question. It was a rhetorical question. I just wanted to say that you are your own home. Welcome yourself inside. You will find many doors to open. Oh, that sounds mysterious and beautiful. I'll try to do that some other time. Bye. Yeah, I got a bucket of water. Okay. Fireberries. Climb up the thing. Climb the moose. Okay. Okay. Now that I got some water. Fire's gone, I can take berries. And I still got water. Sweet. Um, that on that. Yay! Cool. Climb on down, friend. Okay. Depillalalalalize. Use on him. Sir, I brought the fire berries, but they are not on fire anymore. Magnificent! They will do just fine. Thank you very much, my darling. Sir Edward, here's the bucket full of water. I got help from the shiny insects. You mean the Luciferans? They are nice, yes, but only when you see them in this reality. They're very dangerous. If you ever see them in the fifth reality, they can burn you. Wow, burn me? Well... I haven't been to the fifth reality yet. I don't recommend it. What's what's reasonable there may be the worst you'll ever experience. Oh, I forgot to thank you for the water. Thank you, Fran. Ah, Fran, it's 2.34. The journey will begin. Let's go inside the machine. Wow. Come on, kitty. It's 2.36. We have a great possibility of reaching the target in good condition. We'll soon be on our way to the third reality. Are you excited, Fran? Maybe. 
I would be excited if I could understand more about the realities. You'll soon understand. The answers are not easy to recognize. Oh, that sounds strange to me, sir. Time goes as it has to, in order for you to be alive. The fuck? If it all happens now, you'll probably explode. Eh. Are you telling... <clears throat> Are you telling me that the answers I'm looking for will come to me when they want? Not exactly. You know what? I'd rather say... Though time, you have to explore and experience to understand. This means the answers will come when you find them. Not when others tell you how or where to find them. Ah, I see. Well, I'm excited now. You woke up my... You woke up my curiousness. That's the best thing you can you can do for yourself. Be curious and you'll always be amazed. But now, Fran, we have to get things done. Talking won't take you home. What things, sir? The machine needs some maintenance and I think you would do incredible work. Here are the fireberries and the water you gathered before. You'll need them to get the water pump working again and the fuel mixed. You'll find them all the information you need when you enter the room to the left. But feel free to enter any room you wish. I'll be quite busy fixing the automatic driver. But if you have something to ask, I'll be here. Mm, but I've never done anything like this before. That makes it more exciting. Have fun, my darling. Alright, I'll go now. There's a button. Aha. Kitty. Oh, so he had the mechanical doll for, of Mr. Midnight. Wow, that's a huge spinning top. Oh. Aha. <laughs> Pink hose maybe can connect somewhere. Blue hose. Ready to use. Oh boy. I don't think I'm ready for this. Scrap? Doesn't know about hiding. Reality view, ultra reality view, chemical mixture, micro nutrients and fibers will supercharge and Engine and a shirt lens forever. Blurred. Okie dokie. I understand none of this. Yet. Keyboard is yet. Okay, I'm gonna check other. Hello, Mr. Midnight. And so many other ones. I'm just gonna look around a clock. That looks like a teapot with forks and spoons. Oh, it's King Czar. I recognize him. Press the button. Not gonna go up ladders. Door is locked. Maybe I can open it here. Okay. The ladder leads to the door, but the but is closed. Okay, so nothing I need is in there. Can't do anything about that. Mm. Let's look at this real quick. Um, excuse me? Shoe, feet. Take skin off of foot. Put on shoe.
That's disturbing. And of course, it's in a weird language. Right. Okay, probably have to fire this up. going. Mature AFM 18 2 2PF R15 N16166 something or other, something or other. Which means I'm taking a picture with my phone. <laughs> so this goes into that. Okay, so this goes into this one. So what if we'd use. I want to use it. Use this into that, okay. So do we need another piece? Is this is this is what it, this is? Cause the green one's supposed to go from both of these into this. And this. Okay, so that is correct. Well, it's kinda hard, Sir Edward, when um yeah. Oh, so I can light that. So that needs to be over there. That needs to be like that. And that needs to be that way. Okay, give me a second. I might be almost done. So that needs to be like that. That needs to be like that. That needs to be like that. I need that. Ta-da! Um, I'm actually, I can't take my pills like that. I can't take them like this, though. Yeah, that's what I needed to do. That's what I needed to do. Creature with a bunch of eyes. Of course. Seconds and minutes and hours and days. Tick tock, tick tock. Fun. Everything's exactly how we wanted it. Use like that. And use like those. Utimus. The octopus hose is in the right place. Ah, an octopus hose. So these. So I'm in the ultra reality and I have the fire berries. So this container. So, okay. So I need, no, I want that in you. Okay. Oh, I can drag and do things with them. Not like that. 18 in 18 in this one and then this one and this one cool why isn't shit mixing because I don't have that one um use alright Is 
I mean, it was the only thing I could do. What was I supposed to do? crush him? No. Oh. Super kind of Shinaster Frambo. So I have now this. Cool. So I did it right. Hey! Yay. Fran! I finally managed to fix the automatic driver. Do you need help? I think I managed myself quite well. I did all you asked me. Blah. Very well, Fran. Everything seems to be in working perfectly. Yes, everything looks absolutely great. What should we do now, sir? Well, I wanted to ask you if you were afraid of rabbits. There's a little rabbit in one of the rooms, and I'm, I'm deeply afraid of it. Would you like to help me get rid of it? A rabbit? I guess it depends on the rabbit, sir. With all of the things I've seen, I just can't imagine one kind of rabbit. Is it a chocolate rabbit? Or one with horns and killer eyes? You'll see for yourself. It has a pink nose and blue boots. It's just sitting there. No blinking, no movement. It's staring all the time. It does sound very scary, sir, but show it to me. Otherwise, I will never know. Brave you are, dear. Follow me. <laughs> okay. There. See it? It's just sitting there. Isn't it a strange behavior? From what I see, it's just a toy, sir. It won't move. Would you please make a contact with it? I don't dare to touch it. All right, sir. I'll make the rabbit. I'll take the rabbit and show you. There's nothing to be afraid of. See, it's just a fluffy rabbit. Nothing to be afraid of. Oh, you're right, friend. There is nothing to be afraid of. What? Don't go, Mr. Midnight. This is not funny. it's to this. Use? No, 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 no. Examine. Can't open it. Well, if you let me, I might be able to. Took a wrench. This one say in a des in a des tre crat shent. Really? You're actually going to make me do this? There. Oh boy. Battery. Right. 
Okay. Wow, oh, Miss Catacol Arm, are you alive? For some odd reason. You need to be all the way over there. Fran, you're too slow. Pick up the little bunny rabbit. We're gonna go have some fun. So five, six, seven. Oh, that's eight. Nine. Wait, what is this also? Why is this also eight? Hmm. I might have to leave this here and potentially look up tutorial on how to figure this part out anyways but i'm gonna have to leave this here because i am absolutely stumped being yeah uh so i hope you guys are liking this and i do love the frambo stuff i really do i like doing the voice acting and all that fun fun fairy whimsy stuff like that uh, but i hope you guys are like this and until next time but whatever i make have a great day and beautiful life bye